Samsung Notes, the best notes app ever created. Period. Hear me out on these 12 special features and by the end of this video you would be saying the same. Out of these, number 2 and number 9 are the ones that I use the most and are my personal favorites. So without any further delay, let's start. Number 1. Drag and Drop This feature enables us to separate any image from a photo and directly drag it into the note. The cutout is automatically detected and hence the note taking becomes easier. It also does a really good job of separating human subjects if you need that for any reason. After dragging and dropping, you can continue annotating your note. Number 2. App Pairs This feature is my personal most used feature. Although this feature isn't per se of Samsung Notes, however, I use it with the Samsung Notes the most. Say you want to watch lectures and take notes on your tab. What you normally do is open the notes first, then open your app or a video lecture, then adjust them on split screen and then get ready to take the notes. Now look at this. Boom. To create an app pair, first manually create a split screen between two apps. Then click on these three dots, then click on the star and you're done. Now you can directly access the app pair with just one click. Number three, favorite pens. Now you might think how come favorite pens is a special feature or what's so special about it? Well, the special thing about it is the way you switch between your favorite pens. Let me demonstrate. Amazing, right? So how to do it? First, you need to choose your favorite pens, click on pens and then select the color and size of your favorite pen and then click on the star. It will be added to your favorite pens list. Now to switch between your pens, pull away the S Pen from your screen till the hover pointer disappears. When it disappears, just press the button on the S Pen and you're done. Number 4. PDF Annotations Samsung Notes isn't just your note taking app. You can store your PDF books here and annotate them too. It will save all of your books at one place and keep them organized. All you need to do is click on the PDF file and open it with Samsung Notes Convert to Note, not the PDF Writer. Now the PDF will appear in the Samsung Notes app and you can annotate and highlight your PDF all at one place. Number 5. Screen of Memos So suppose you are just sitting doing nothing and all of a sudden you remember something and you immediately need to jot it down. Are you suddenly got some doubt and you need to write it down immediately so that you can revisit it later on. Just pick up your S Pen and keep the button pressed and just tap it on the screen. And there we go. You can write anything and click on save. All the screen of memos get saved in Samsung Notes in an automatically created folder named screen of memos. Number 6. Voice recording has it ever happened to you that you made notes for a particular lecture and later on upon revising, you yourself don't seem to recall what a particular line written on your note points to? Well, Samsung Notes has taken care of that too, using the voice recording feature. So what you need to do is click on this paper clip and click voice recording and normally take your notes. Let me show it how useful this feature can be. If you have come this far, then do subscribe to my channel it's free now see what happens when i play it back it highlights each word as it was written along with the audio you will find it very useful in many case scenarios number seven folders if you're anything like me you love keeping things at their proper place and as you pile up your notes it becomes even more necessary with samsung notes you can create folders color them Create subfolders, color them as well, keep everything organized and easy to find. This will save you a lot of time. Number 8. Page Templates Do you guys remember when we were little children and as we grew older how our notebooks transitioned from four liner to graphs to single lines to diaries and whatnot? Well, you can get all those page templates at one place. Samsung Notes has some default templates which will cover almost all of your needs. However, if you want to get a bit funky and creative, you can download any kind of template from internet and use it on your notes. Apart from these, the app also has calendar planners, to-do lists, diary templates in PDF sections too. You can check all of them. Despite the graph template being the most popular all around the internet, I myself use the conventional single line template. Number 9. Log Canvas This feature is a lifesaver and a frustration saver as well. While writing notes, you might have accidentally zoomed in or scrolled by accidental touches. And we all know how irritating it can be. This is where Lock Canvas comes to our rescue. Upon clicking on it, the page can only be scrolled using two fingers. 
It keeps the page aligned and makes it easier to write. I always keep this feature enabled. This feature prevents a lot of accidental touches. Although even without it, accidental touches are negligible, but enabling it just doubles on it and makes the experience even better. Number 10. Pens and Highlighters Samsung Notes has every type of pen, from calligraphy pen to marker to pencil to brush. You are mostly going to use the normal pen, however, it is good to have options. Also, I really like the straight line highlighter. It helps to highlight stuff without creating a mess. Everything neat and tidy, as it should be. Number 11. Easy Writing Pad If you grew up like me and had a habit of underlining different words and fitting the extra information on the book page itself, you're gonna love this feature. Once you click on this feature, this box appears and you need to place it near the position where you want to write the fine text. Say, let's drag it here. Now you can write anything in the zoomed window at the bottom. It will appear in the main canvas where the box is placed. This tool will give you a lot of control over fine text writing. Now let me mention the most important feature of Samsung Notes. Number 12. It's free. This without any doubt is the best thing about the app. It's free and comes preloaded. No one-time purchase or no subscription. It is updated periodically and you can sync your notes to Samsung Cloud. So basically, it's the best app out there for us medical students. Now that you are aware of the best note-taking app, you should also be aware of the best AI assistant for medical students. Click on the video on the left for that. And to choose the best app for yourself, click on the video on right. Till then, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Take care and happy learning.